morning. It is Monday morning. Had my coffee, almost got it gone there. And today I am working on July 1st, guys. It's July. Can you believe it? I'm going to have a great July. But did I tell you that I had a 1.2 gain overnight? And I know what exactly it is because we went out to eat yesterday and we had... Culver's Grilled Chicken, and even though I was low on my calories and I had three points left to roll over, I still gained 1.2 pounds or 1.4 or something. Did I say? What did I say? Um, 1.2. So because of that reason, oh, and I think I forgot to show you that yesterday I lost 0.4 from the day from previous day. So, and then I lost 1.2. So I knew it would either be a gain or a small loss because when I have a 1.2 in one day, the next day but weigh-in day guys this was awesome to actually lose weight even though the day before was weigh-in day is that amazing and I had 1600 calories so yeah and I still lost but I didn't have the sodium that I had on this day so the sodium yesterday just for lunch was 1500 calories that sandwich we just had the sandwich and I had a small diet Pepsi, which wasn't bad on sodium, but the sandwich was close to 1,500 alone. Plus, I had all these additives, and plus we forgot another um, something. I don't know, but it was over 3,000 milligrams yesterday. And I'm supposed to be sticking to 2,300 milligrams in one day. I am on heart, uh, blood pressure medication, so my weight really goes up a lot when I overdo my sodium. I just also realized, guys, that I forgot to take my meds on Sunday. So I forgot to take my heart uh, blood pressure medication on Sunday. And that will definitely explain some of that for sure. So I won't forget tonight. We'll see what tomorrow turns out to be like. So that's where that plus is coming from. And I'm sure it'll be down tomorrow, assuming I stick to my points. <laughs> So we'll see how that is. Is I gotta try to keep my sodium lower today, so I'm not gonna add any sodium to my breakfast. Try to keep track of where I am there on the sodium. I got less than six hours of sleep because my hand. I had right through here, I had like 15 white bumps. I was scratching it all night, all night. And I could not sleep. So then about two o'clock in the morning I got up and I ran into this stuff. Finally, this worked. I know it's not meant for, for that kind of itching, but it worked and I was able to fall asleep. Now it still does itch a little bit, but not nothing like it did. I was putting on cortisone 10, every other itch medicine that I had purchased because I was desperate. I tried all of it, didn't work. I still kept waking up and then I tried this stuff and it it allowed me to sleep. It was still itchy, but it allowed me to sleep and forget about it. So thankfully for this stuff, Preparation H, hemorrhoidal cream, I could finally go to sleep. So this is going to stay at my side because I, I walked Eclipse yesterday for half a mile and I'm sure I got bitten up by whatever bug likes me out there. I don't know. And oh, my ring is really, you can tell I'm swelled up because my ring is tight too. So weird. Okay, I'm gonna drink a bunch of water today and I will let you know how tomorrow turns out. Where Luna's at the vet's office. She's just shivering like crazy. Poor Luna. <laughs> Poor little Luna. She's got a little sore foot. Oh, <laughs> she got blood drawn today. She wants me to take it off. You want that off, Luna? You want that off, Luna? She wants me to take it off. All right, guys, this is my this is my breakfast this morning. I have one egg, three grams of Asiago cheese, which is zero smart points. I grated it really super fine. Half of a chicken sausage, which is one. 65 grams of the hash brown potatoes, the diced potatoes, which are one. So that makes this one, two, two smart points. Two smart points because zero points of the Asiago cheese. So two smart points for this humongous breakfast and it's very, very tasty. 
I have about six ounces of the Cotton Candy Grapes, 100 calories for six ounces. That's what I'm having for snack this morning. These are so delicious. I can't help myself. I did have to weigh them out though, or I find that I could eat the whole container worth. My second cup of coffee and a Diet Dr. Pepper. All right, guys, I'm having lunch and I decided to have another one of those grilled cheese with the onions and tomato there. It was so good. Um, about a half an ounce of cheese or a half an ounce of ham, which is zero smart points. So this whole sandwich is three points. I do have one slice of Velveeta on there. And then I'm having a bag of the mac and cheese potato sticks with my second glass of water. That is it for lunch. I mentioned that the grilled cheese was three points. I think I did. Having a serving of the rolled corn tortilla chips and boy, is this bag spicy. So that is really good because I'm not even sure if I can finish this serving. My lips are burning. My tongue is burning. They are extra spicy this time, but I like them. Okay, guys, I didn't have one. I didn't have two, but I ended up having three of these darn bill bars. I really like these kind. So tomorrow I'm not having any built bars. <laughs> so that is what I did today. Add some more sodium to the day. I ended up having two of the string cheese with two slices of bruschetta. Bruschetta, prosciutto. <laughs> Never can say that right. By the way, this is four smart points. Okay, I have leftover chili. One smart point. Three smart points of cottage cheese. That is going to be dinner tonight. Having cottage cheese for a snack and my fourth water tonight. Okay, guys, today is July 1st, and I totally expected to have a really good day today, but I did not have a really good day today. I ended up gaining 1.2, and that is because I had a crap ton of sodium, like I said, and I remember that I forgot my blood pressure meds. So I figured, okay, I will do better today and recover from that. Nope, I didn't. I had three coffees. I had two Diet Cokes. Plus I had my breakfast, lunch, and dinner were actually good. I had chili, grilled cheese for lunch. Breakfast was my deluxe breakfast for $2.40. But then I went and had some Trader Joe chips. I had a serving and just a touch over with those. Plus I had three Bilt Bars. I had two and then I went back and had one more. So, and then I had mac and cheese sticks. So all this sodium was insane. And I had cottage cheese, again, too, for a snack. So my points totaled 32 points, guys, 32. So I did not get a dot bummed today, but I tracked everything and I feel pretty good about it. But my calories, guys, was 1,880 because I had that extra built Bar there. So it wasn't all that terrible. I mean, it was, but it wasn't. I'm still not at 2000 calories. So that is not that bad. So now I am going to be doing July 2nd tomorrow. These are my goals for tomorrow. I'm not going to have three coffees. I'm only going to have one Diet Coke, if any. I'm going to try for none and we'll see how that works out. And I'm going to recover from yesterday. <laughs> so those are my goals for July 2nd. I'm going to move on. And I had all my weeklies to use. I'm going to start earning some of those back now. I'm going to close out the video here because I am cleaning tonight and doing my dishes and all of that stuff. So I'm going to close it out here right away. I will see you guys in the morning. I'm going to stick with it. Have a great day tomorrow. And I will bring you along and show you what I do tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And be sure to share this if you think anybody else may like it. Bye guys. Eclipse says bye as well. <laughs>